Y'all let me know if there's any of that feedback. Last night, some of the ladies had said that there was a, like a zap feedback or, or something was weird with my voice. So y'all let me know. I tried to make sure I was on two different internet streams. But let's go ahead and give a couple big shoulder rolls right here. <laughs> We're gonna reach up real high, reach to the sky, stretch our tummies. Let's give a little baby back bend right here, field goal arms, opening up our shoulders right here. One more time, straight up to the sky, baby back bend. All right, let's head to the end of our mats and do a couple walkouts right here. Straight up and walk out to a plank. Walk it back. Stand up big and tall. Let's stretch on a full body stretch. Back down to a plank. Ah, let's keep this going a couple more times. Last time I want you to stay down at your plank right here. I want you to take your right leg and bring it up with your hands. We've got the runner's lunge right here. So I want you to push your hip flexor, your left hip flexor down to the ground. I want you to take your arm, right arm behind your ear and I want you to stretch that elbow down to your toes or your shin or your knees, whatever you can do. That'll push your hip flexor down just a little bit more. Reach that right arm up to the sky. Let's do that again. Elbow to your toes, shins, or knee. Hand up to the sky. One more time. Elbow up to the sky. Let's take that left leg, or sorry, right leg and move it back. Two push-ups right here. One, two. Take that left leg, bring it up to, the, up to your hands. We're gonna do the same thing. Hand to the back of the head, elbow to the toes, reach up to the sky. One more time. Nope, sorry, two more times. All right, last time down to the toes, up to the sky. We're gonna kick that left leg back to the back again. We're back in our plank. Two more push-ups. One, two. Bring our booty to the air. We're in a pipe right now. I want you to go ahead and walk those knees out. Get a couple good stretch in the backs of your legs. You're pushing your hips and your butt up to the sky. Bending at the knees, trying to get your heels to the ground a little bit. All right, let's walk it all the way up. Big stretch at the top. We're gonna move back to the center of our mat and we're gonna start hands, or sorry, feet right, shoulder more than shoulder width apart. We're gonna reach down, little lunges right here, little side to side lunges. Touching the opposite hand to the inner, inner side of your toe. Toes are pointed forward. I want you to go ahead and add your hands in here so that opposite arm goes up in the air. Kind of like a teeter-totter right here. Two. One, all right, let's bring the legs in a little bit closer together. Let's do a little bit of a narrow squat right here. Slow and controlled, squeezing at the top. Get your hands in there, wake up those arms. Two more. All right, look at the top. Give me some big arm circles right here to the front. Hey, Tina, I'm going to go ahead and pause you or mute you. Oh, no, you did it. You're good. You're good. Okay, reverse those arms, big arm circles to the back. All right, give me some jumping jacks. One of our moves in our cardio blast is called a seal jack. What we're gonna do is take this to up a notch, engaging our arms, and we're gonna be moving the arms back and forth right here in front of us. 
So you could be here, tapping out, shoulders engaged, like you've got strings on the back of them, or you're here. Three, two, one. Grab a drink of water. We're gonna start our cardio blast just in a second. Get that heart rate up. All right, we got high knees on the board first, and then we're gonna do cross jacks. We're gonna do step it out to the seal jacks, but I'll give you cues whenever we're switching over to transition. So I want you to start, high knees right here. You're either here, stepping up, or we're kicking on and driving our knees up high. So again, you're either here, driving your knees up, you can pump your arms, or you're here, right here. We're gonna take it to a cross knee in five seconds. Three, two, one, we're here, slow motion. You're crossing at the center. We're gonna take it up a notch in five seconds. And we're gonna add a hop in, or you stay here. Two, one, add a hop. Three, two, one, step it out, jacks. We're here. When you're ready, let's go to regular jumping jacks. In five seconds, we're gonna take it up to the seal jacks. Three, two, one, engage those arms. So you're here, tapping it out. Are you here? Three, two, one, let's squat. Slow and control. Squeezing at the top, chest up. We're gonna take it up a notch to squat jumps, or you can stay right here. Three, two, one. Get off the ground, or stay in that jack, or stay in that squat. We got five more seconds. Come on, come on. All right, meet me on the ground. We're in a plank. We're gonna bring that right leg up to the top, back to the back, to the left, back to the back. Get ready, we're gonna go two legs at once. Jump to the side, back to the center. Jump to the side, back to the center. You can be here, still walking it out. Booties down, or you jump to the side, back to the center. Side, center. All right, y'all, get down into this bear hole right here. You're right here, tap your legs back. Tap them back. Tap the toe back. Keep it going. Can you jump it out, jump it in. Jump it out, jump it in. Keep that hover in your knees. All right, stand it up. Shake it out for a second. We're gonna do that whole set all over again. Starting with the high knees. So we're here, stepping it out. In one second, we're gonna take it up to high knees. Three, two, one, high knees, go, go, go. Go, 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 go. Get those knees up there. We got 15 more seconds, and we're gonna go to those cross jacks. Three, two, one, squat, cross, cross, squat, cross. You ready to add that hop in there? Or you stay here. Three, two, one, hop. Come on, we're only here for 10 more seconds.
Low impact jets. Ready? You're here. Tapping it out. Get ready for those seal jacks. Three, two, one. So you can still be doing the tap out jacks. Get ready for the transition. We're gonna squat in three, two, one, squat. Let your breath come down just a little bit. Active recovery. Get ready for those squat jumps. Three, two, one, jump. Or keep your squat, keep your squat. Next up is plank. Three, two, one, to the ground. In a plank, we're walking each leg up. When you're ready, you're gonna hop to the left, right, hop to back, hop to the left. Knees and ankles together. Or you stay right in that beginner's position. Back's flat. Three, two, one. Get that bear hold. You're on all fours, just like this. Raise those knees just two inches above the ground. Hold it here. Hold it. Tap it back. See if you can just tap, take turns alternating, tapping those toes back. Can you jump it back? Jump it in. Jump it back. Jump it in. Three. Two, one, on your feet, rest, recovery. Whew. This is a good sweaty one. Whew. Now make sure to tap it out, keep it moving, grab a drink of water, bring that heart rate down just a little bit before we jack it back up. I'm already sweating, goodness. <sighs> For today's class, we are gonna need medium weights. You might want heavy weights for good mornings. This, that's where you put the weight on your back right here, or hold it right here, and we are just hinging at the waist, straight back, pushing our booties back, soft knees. That's what's first up. Um, do have a very light weight for our last move in this transition or in the circuit nearby because we're going to be on our ground doing supermans right here transitioning like this. All right, each interval, there are, whew, this first interval is a minute and 30 seconds, but you got it. It's an easy move. You got your weights right here. Bring them to your chest. We're hinging at the waist, soft knees. Pushing our booty back, back straight. You can also have two weights to where you throw them right here, kind of on the, your shoulders, but more on your back of your shoulder blades. Be careful not to have the weight on your spine in the back of your neck. Straight backs, push your booty back. Your knees are only slightly bent. And we're more than halfway done. You got this. Keep it going. 30 more seconds. Big bends. Check your back, make sure it's straight. You got it. When you're standing up, make sure you stand up straight, squeeze your cheeks. You should feel a pull in the back of your hamstrings or in the back of your upper thigh. We're here for five more seconds. Three, two, one. All right. Grab a lighter weight if you have one. We've got five sub curls. 
bicep curls right here to a high pull. A minute 30 on the board. We're doing a climbing ladder. So it goes like this. One, one. Now we go two, two. Y'all get it? Three, three. You can do this without weights. We're making sure we're not rocking. Working against gravity. When you do that upper pull, you wanna make sure you're driving those elbows up to the ceiling. It's into your chest, painting your, painting your torso right here. So bicep curls. It starts sneaking up on you at the end. Starting to burn. Come on, paint that torso, zip that zipper up. Bicep curls. Make sure you're not over here rocking. Keep those, keep those hips steady. It's all the movement is in your arm. 15 more seconds, guys, you got it. Come on. Elbows to the sky. Three, two, one, shake it out. We got sumo squats up next. This set is 45 seconds. You can do this. Grab a heavier weight or two weights right here. Hold them in the center of your chest or you can have them down at the bottom. We're going low with the knees or your elbows should be in your knees. As low as you can go. Straight backs, booties down to the ground. Feet are facing forward. If you can't get all the way down, it's okay. Go as far as you can go, maintaining a good posture. Straight backs, chest up. We got 15 more seconds, you guys got this. Squeezing your booty at the top, chest up. Three, two, one, shake it out. Put those weights down. We're down on the ground for a glute bridge, abduction. Remember that you're flat on your back. We're driving our hips up to the ceiling. And when they're up there, we're holding them and we're flexing our knees out. Get ready. 45 seconds on the clock. You can have a weight on your hips if you want to. Let's go. Hips up, knees out, down. Hips up, knees out, down. This is a slow, controlled movement. Squeezing that booty at the top. 15 more seconds. Seven. You got this. Squeeze. Three, two, one. Five. One bit off in the bottom. Slip it over. We're in that bear claw position. Again, right here. Raise your knees up, just two inches off the ground. And so we're going to do an up down. So you ready? Let go. Down, down, up, up. Down, down, up, up. All three arms. Otherwise, that one arm can be put down. So we're going to walk around here. Keep that back straight. We got 60 seconds. You can always be on all fours. Straight back, down, down. It's too much to have over there. Uh, no way. We're in a wide arm punch up. Take your hands more than with the view mat. And get in that pipe. And let's hold it here. The further your arms are out, the more difficult this is going to be. The closer in, the, the more easy. You can go to your knees. Get the knees up. Just make sure we've got straight backs. We're only here for 10 more seconds because we've already done 20. You got this. Come on, tummies in tight, backs down. Three, two, one. Lay on the ground. This is where I want you to grab those light weights. We're in a swimmer right here. Legs off the ground, chest off the ground, and we're taking our arms over our head, hovering over the ground. From this head, 
to our booty, from our head to our booty. So we're kind of doing a, a superwoman meets a swimmer. Make sure your eyes are gazing just slightly above your mat. Straight neck, stretch spines. Three, two, one, waves down. Take it back to child's pose for just a second. We got our power move on your feet. Here's where we're at right here. We are doing a narrow soft squat. So we're here to a wide squat here, back to a narrow squat here, back to a wide squat. Your feet are facing forward the whole time. That's your pattern. 20 seconds there. Then we're gonna take it up a notch or you stay in that pattern. Narrow squat, wide squat, narrow squat, wide squat. Y'all join me. Ready? Go. Narrow, wide, narrow, wide. So in five seconds, we're gonna jump on those narrows. Ready? Go. Jump, wide, narrow, jump, wide. Get some air. Keep it going. Two, one, rest. Circuit one is done. We're doing that all over again. Grab a drink of water. We're good. We got about 15 more seconds. We're gonna move right in to those good mornings. So you want that heavier weight on your shoulders or right on front of your chest. And we're hinging at the waist, straight backs. Get ready, three, two, one, let's go. Whew, sorry, so we're here. Hinging at the waist, booties pushed back, your knees are soft. Keeping the weight right on your body. So either right at your chest, right on your shoulders, more on your shoulder blades. This exercise is a little bit easier to do with a barbell because you put it on the center of your back. But we can still do it like this and we're getting things done. And that, I feel like it might be my cheesy saying of the day. I might be able to come up with something better. Keep it going. Soft knees, straight backs. Keep that weight at that chest. Working against gravity, squeezing your cheeks at the top, getting that bathing suit bottom booty. Come on, 25 more seconds, you got this. This is a long one, but we can do it. Keep it going. Push that booty back. Get that stretch in that hamstring. Five, four, three, two, one. Woo, get ready. Grab that lighter weight if you want to. We need two weights. We have that bicep curl to a high pull ladder climb. It's a minute 30, but we got this. Get ready, let's go. Roll those shoulders down and back. Bicep curl, high pull. Bicep curl, two. High pull, two. Three. Paint that chest or zip that zipper all the way up to your neck. Make sure your backs are straight and your knees are soft. Don't lock out those knees. Nobody passing out today. Not that that's happened. <laughs> I mean, I did it once, but that was when I was 18 years ago, years ago. Woo. Climb that ladder. You got this, we're more than halfway done. It's not about how many reps you do. It's more about keeping that good form 
work against gravity. So again, let's make sure we're not here rocking at the bicep curl. You want to keep stationary and all of the movement is right here in your arms, building that bicep. And then right here on these high pulls, your shoulders will really start burning. Don't give in because we got three more seconds. You got this. Two, one, shake it out. We got a sumo squat. So grab that weight. Remember, we got weights right here at our chest or we're holding them down right there. And we're squatting down as low as we can go, getting our elbows in between our knees or as low as you can go to where you can keep your booty back and your chest up. Come on, 30 more seconds. You got this. Keep it going. Squat low. Push that booty down. Your back should be straight. We got 10 more seconds. You got this. Get those, try to get those elbows in between our knees. Four, three, two, one. Put those weights down. We're down on the ground for that glute bridge. Driving our hips to the ceiling, and then we'll push our knees out at the top. Get ready. Three, two, one, let's go. Hips up, knees out. Hips up, knees out. Go at your own pace. Work against gravity. Squeeze those cheeks at the top. Come on, come on, we got 20 more seconds. You got this. Make it burn. Next up we have those bear crawls. We're hovering over the ground and we're gonna be planking up and down. Up downs, bear crawl, up downs. Two, one, shake it out. Woo, flip it over. Goodness. Sweaty mess over here. Get ready, we're gonna hover those knees in three, Two, one, hover. Let's go up, down. Come on. Up, down. Again, you can have your knees on the ground and we've got straight backs and we're working on up, down. But see if you can take your knees off the ground. Just the tiniest bit. Two, one. Back in that child's pose. Whew. Uh, we got that wide arm push up hold. Hands more than your mat is apart. We're up in that plank in three, two, one. On your knees or on your toes. Wide arms. Hold it. Hold it. See how far you can go. How wide? How wide can you go? We only got. 10 more seconds, you can go, you can do it. If you're on your knees, get on your back. I'm just hoping though, get on your toes. Woo, three, two, one, knees down. Stretch it back into child's pose. We got those swimmers with the round the world. So we're on our tummies. Let's drive our hips into the ground, feet off the ground. We got, I got water bottles for my lightweights. Get ready to hover. Three, two, one. Bring those weights down to your side, up overhead. Down to your side, up overhead. Woo! Check your form. Chest off the ground, feet off the ground. Your hips are dry, drove into the ground. Three, two, one. Water bottles down. <laughs> All right, we got that power move again where it's the narrow squats, wide squat, narrow squat. This time, we're gonna move right into with those jumps or in the center in the narrow squat. Or we're gonna stay. So get ready, three, two, one, we're narrow squat, wide squat, narrow squat, wide squat. Let's do those jumps in the center. Go. 
See how much air you can get. Get that heart rate up. We're only here for 10 more seconds. You got it. Get low in those squats. Two, one, rest, recover. Whew. All right. Round two of circuit one is done. One more rep of that. Starting off with those good mornings for a minute 30. This time, I want you to challenge your body. Work your way through it. If you're comfortable in the weight you're at, take it up a notch. If not, stay where you're at. I don't want to push anyone too far. So, get your weight at your chest or on the back of your shoulders. We're hinging at the waist in three, two, one. Let's go. Pushing our booty back. Squeezing our cheeks at the top. Active recovery right here. If your heart rate's already down. Good. <laughs> Mine is not. Whew. Wow, one more minute here. You got it. Squeeze those cheeks. Push that booty back. Get low in that good morning. It's like you're waking up, bending over, and getting a stretch. You don't bend your knees, they're just soft knees. Squeeze those cheeks to the top. Tummy's in tight. That way you bring some of the work into your core. Hey Michelle, we're doing good mornings. We're hinging at the waist, straight backs, soft knees. 20 more seconds right here. All the work is in your hamstrings and in your cheeks. And if you got your tummies tight, in your core. Come on, eight more seconds. Two, one, get ready for those bicep curls to overhead or to high pulls, ladder, all right? So, I challenge you to go higher if you can. If not, no one knows. We're good. All right, bicep curl, high pull. Bicep curl two times. See, we're building. High pull two times. Bicep curl three. Make sure that all that work is in the arms. High pulling, we're zipping up that zipper up into our neck, driving those elbows up to the ceiling. I think this is five. <laughs> five. Three, four, five, six. Keep that weight in your arms. I'm starting to rock. If you start to rock, go to alternating. It's all good. You don't want to bring that workout into your body. It takes it away from your arms. 30 more seconds. You're killing it. Bicep curl. Woo! It is burning. This is the last time we're doing this. So give it your all. Oh. Come on. Come on, come on. Paint those chests. Zip up that zipper. Elbows to the sky. Three seconds, you got this. Push it out, push it out. Two, one, ah! We got sumo squats. <coughs> Hips slightly more than, or sorry, feet slightly more than shoulder hips apart. We got our weights at our chest or down in between, and we are going down, getting our elbows in between our knees or close to it, coming up, squeezing at the top. Straight backs, chest up. Don't forget to squeeze those cheeks. When you do that, I want you to check your stomach. Are you tightening your core? I wasn't, that's why I said something. <laughs> Come on, 10 more seconds. 
seconds. Push it out. Squeeze everything really tight. Last time we're doing this. Three, two, one. Ugh. On the ground, we got glute bridges, hip abductions. So we're on our back. You can have a weight on your hips if you want. We're driving to the ceiling. While we're at the top, we're pushing our knees out. Ready? Go. At your own pace. Squeeze those cheeks at the top. Drive those knees out like you got a rubber band around them. Work against your imaginary force. 20 more seconds, you guys got this. It's really funny, if you imagine that rubber band's there, for some reason, like my head actually thinks it's more difficult to pull, pull my knees apart. Woo, five more seconds. Three, two, one. Bear crawl, flip it over. Y'all got sweat dripping in my eyes, it's burning. <laughs> You're in all fours. Take those knees slightly hovered over the ground. We're gonna be going up, down, sorry, up. Down, down, up, up. You can be on your knees, onto your elbows, back to your hands. Or let's take it, the knees hovering. Make sure you're alternating arms. We're here for three more seconds. Come on, back straight. Two, one, wide arm push up hold. Hurry, hurry, get in that wide arm plank. Like you're gonna do a really wide arm push up. Get on your toes or on your knees and hold that plank. We're only here for 20 more seconds. See how wide you can go. This is the last time we'll be doing this one. 10 more seconds. You got this. On your toes, flat back. Tummy's in tight. Booty's down. Come on, come on. You're shaking. Three, two, one. Knees down. Let's go into those swimmers. Lay down flat. Drive your hips into the ground. Bringing your feet up off the ground. Hands are hovering out above you, in front of you. And let's drive them down to your side, making a big circle or a half circle with each arm. Check yourself, hips in the ground, booty squeezed tight. Hands are hovering. Check your spine, make sure your head is in line with your back. We got five more seconds right here. Come on, two, one, water bottles down. <laughs> I say that like y'all have, maybe you do have the water bottles. <sighs> All right, let's get to our feet. Last time we're gonna be doing this, that narrow squat. I'm showing Michelle. Narrow squat and all the YouTubers that join. Wide squat, back to narrow, back to wide. Narrow, wide, narrow, wide. All right, keep that pattern up. I'm starting our timer. Narrow, wide. Let's add that jump in the narrow. Ready? Let's go. If your knees bother you, I want you to stay just doing the squats. Taking this jump out. Feet are pointing forward. Your thighs should be burning. Come on, five more seconds. Two, one, done. That circuit is done. We will never do that again. Woo. Grab a drink of water. Let's let the heart rate come down just a little bit. Ha. Keep your head up. Tap it out. Oh, goodness, ladies. All right, let's see. We're moving right back into lunges because we didn't get enough work on our legs yet. So this set is set up just like the last one. 
we're doing 30, uh, a minute 30, a minute 30, and then 45 seconds, 45 seconds, and then three sets of 30 seconds. And we'll, that's one circuit. And we'll repeat that circuit three times, just like the last one with power moves at the end of each circuit. All right, so first off, we are slightly, feet slightly more than shoulder width apart. We are just gonna be side lunging, staying low. So go do, to your lunge and let's start going side to side. You're here for a minute, 30. I know you can do it. Take that pain out of your mind. Go somewhere like the beach. That's where I'm going. I'm going to the beach in my head because I'm not going to real life. Stay low. Stay low, side to side. You can have a weight here if you want to. If it starts burning too bad, I want you to stand up for one second. Bring it back down. Stay low. Y'all are counting. it. We got a minute left. I know I shouldn't have told you that. <laughs> We're almost done. <laughs> stay low, stay low. Whoo, these are burning. Come on, we're halfway done. You're killing it. Chest up, chest up, back straight. Hinging, push that booty back. Stay low. I keep saying that because I want to go up. <laughs> Woo, come on, we got 20 more seconds. You got this. Stay low, whoo. Don't, don't stand up yet. Don't stand up yet. Come on, 10 more seconds. You got this. Push that booty back. Chest up. Three, two, one, shake it out. We got another ladder climb. So this one's a little awkward looking, but once you get the pattern, you'll get it. So we've got light weights or no weights at all. You're doing a lateral bent arm right here. Going back down, bringing the arm up to a 90 degree angle and doing a bicep curl up here. Get ready. So it's a ladder climb. So you do one, one, two, two, three, three. Make sure those shoulders aren't riding up into your ears. Four. Come on. Four. Keep those arms at 90 degree angles. You want to make believe you're hammering your head in, but don't really do it, please. Come on, we got 30 more seconds. Five. How bad are those arms, Brandon? Oh. If that 90 degree angle starts bothering you, I want you to bring it to right here, okay? So you've got your arms down. It just works different parts of the bicep. Two, one, oh, shake that weight out. We're gonna burn those legs. Let me pause our timer so I can show you what we're doing because this also is a little combination move right here. So we are doing a reverse lunge to a staggered lunge. So you just bring that right leg in from a reverse lunge, squat down again, just a little bit, and then we're going into a squat. So here I'll show you again on a 40 degree, 45 degree angle. So we're going back into a reverse lunge, coming up. Going into a staggered, so you bring that foot in just two or three inches, going back down, coming up, going into a squat. We good? Everybody good? All right. We're just on the right side this first time. So stay on that right leg. 45 seconds, it's gonna hurt. Squat. Reverse, staggered, squat. Reverse. Staggered squat. So that left leg is already burning. Two, 
If this is too much on that left leg, I want you to alternate legs. You're good. Or do half lunges. Keep it going, 10 more seconds. We're really burning those legs out, y'all. Two, one, shake that left leg out. We're gonna give some love to that other leg. Reverse lunges on the left leg. Get ready. Three, two, one, let's go. Reverse, staggered, squat. Reverse, staggered, squat. Reverse, staggered, squat. Chest up. Keep messing up with my weights right there. Keep it going, y'all. Reverse, staggered, squat. Push those booties back and down. Keep it going. We got eight more seconds. Woo! These are burning. Two, one. Shake it out. Let's do a little bit of cardio. Y'all ready? Grab one weight. We're gonna do toe taps. Just 30 seconds where you're here, tapping your toe on that way. Join me when you're ready. We're just tapping that way. No toe taps. You can do a jog in place as well. You can do a step out. Right here, we're just getting the heart rate up a little bit. Come on, come on. Five more seconds. Go, go, go. All right. Whew. Y'all, this is where you're gonna absolutely hate me. These are called thigh killers. <laughs> I talked about this the other night with Natalie. All right, so we're gonna picture ourselves in a little tiny building, okay? We are going to jump out a little bit, jump out again, jump in, jump in. So you're staying in that spot. Jump out, jump out, jump in, jump in. You got it? Stay in that squat. It's only 30 seconds, you can totally do it. Get in that tiny building. Let's jump out, jump out, jump in, jump in. Little tiny hops. Come on. You can also do this moving forward. And that's what really, <laughs> Woo! Two, one. I want y'all down in the bear crawl hole. So you're down on all fours. Get ready. Back straight. We're gonna elevate those knees in three, two, one. Weight in your toes and in your hands. Your knees are just the tiniest bit elevated off the ground. Chest and tummy in. Back straight. We're only 15 more seconds. You got it. We're just holding this. Just holding it here. Five more seconds. Sweat stripping off my face. Three, two, one, down. Ooh. Let's see. Okay, get ready for a little power move. Feel up on your feet. We're gonna work up to this one. So we have a reverse lunge, a reverse lunge, and then a walkout burpee. So you're here, you step back, step back, step in, step in. Stand up straight, reverse lunge, reverse lunge. Walk out burpee. You see what I'm doing? We're going slow. So reverse lunge, opposite reverse lunge, stand up straight, hinge, walk out burpee, walk it in, stand up. Keep it going. Because we might just take that up a notch. Hinge at the waist, walk out, walk out. Walk in, walk in. Can y'all join me? Plyo. If you have bad knees, please stay out with what we just did. So, your lunge jump, lunge jump, stand up straight, burpee. 
lunge jump, lunge jump, burpee, lunge jump, lunge jump, burpee. All right, rest. Y'all rest. That's the end of circuit one. Oh my goodness. I'm a hot, sweaty mess. Grab a drink of water. Let's bring that heart rate down just the tiniest bit. Coming up next, we have those low side to side lunges. And those are called gorilla burpees. Those, when you do them at full pace, they are a burner. All right, so starting off, feet more than shoulder width apart. We're doing low side to side lunges. We're staying low. We're right here. Stay low, stay low. Oh goodness. Well, we're just gonna do the fun part of this round and then we'll do abs. Stay low, stay low. Come on, we got a minute left. You guys are killing it. Stay real low. Push those booties back, chest up. How low can you get? Can you get that leg parallel to the ground? Come on, last time we're doing this. Come on, come on. You got this. We are way more than halfway done. I'm not gonna tell you yet how many more. <laughs> come on. Ah, it's burning. 20 more seconds. You got this. Chest up, back straight. Heads up, look at that computer screen or look past it looking, looking at the wall, picturing you're at the beach. 10 more seconds. You got this, you're killing it. Whoo! We're burning. Three, two, one. Stretch it out. Shake it out. That burn, that burn. So bad. All right, let's go. Ah, let's go. We gotta do one more exercise. If we do one more exercise, then we'll have enough time to do our abs. Let's do, let's finish those legs out. All right, you ready for those staggered lunges? So we're gonna be here, reverse lunge full, staggered, and then the squat. Right side's doing the movement. Let's go, full lunge, staggered, squat. Let's burn these legs out. And if you did Stephanie's Pilates class or spin, you're probably really killing me or screaming at me right now. Ten more seconds, you're killing it. Keep it going. Three, two, one. Shake that left leg out. Get ready to switch it over. We're gonna go in three, two, one. Lunge back, staggered lunge, squat. Lunge back, staggered, squat. Come on, keep it going. Staggered squat. Chest up, you guys. Keep your breathing in check. Squat down. Get those booties to the ground. 10 more seconds. That right leg is on fire. Three, two, one. Shake it out. All right, show of hands that wants to do some gorilla burpees. Thumbs up or we want to move into abs. <laughs> oh, <laughs> I have mixed emotions. Let's just do two gorilla burpees, either walking them out or at full pace. So remember, it's lunge back, lunge back, 
square feet. You're walking it out or you're doing it at full press, full pace. Come on. Ah. Woo. Y'all are killing this workout. All right, let's go to abs. Let's go to abs. My music died. That means I'm gonna sing. My husband said, no, please don't. All right. Okay. So I'm introducing all these new things. Here's what I want you to do. You're either right here in the, in the plank or and you're coming in, coming in, if you can, or you're on your knees in a plank, stepping out. Okay? These are different variations that you do. Or you're doing this which I think it's called a sprawl kick. So we're in a plank, and we're gonna kick in and kick straight out. Kick in and kick straight out. Trying to get as soft as the landing as we can. Driving the knees into the chest, kicking straight back out. So, different things that you can do. You're here, and you can come in to a bear, tapping back out, or you can be on your knees and just tap out in the plank, tapping your toes out to each side of your mat. Or we are going to do 20 seconds of those sprawl kicks. Y'all get ready. Let's go. Ready? Woo! I didn't mean to do that. Come on. 10 more seconds. You got this. Sprawl kick. Land softly. Two. One. Child's pose. Go back to child's pose for a sec. Just a second. Get that good stretch in there. Tri trapezoid. Ah. All right. We're in bear crawl. On all four. Let's hover. You can be here holding it, or I want you to walk your toes back. Walking back into bear crawl. Walk your toes out to plank. Walking back to bear crawl. See if you can alternate feet going back. So not, both feet are not going out at the same time. One foot is always staying in that bear crawl hover. Keep it back straight, keep it going. Three, two, one. Ah. Man, my legs are on fire, y'all. Okay, let's flip it over. We have a mini glute bridge with a crunch. So I want you to crunch. First of all, this is the way, this is the way it goes. Heels on the ground, toes pointed up. You're going to crunch, little crunch, bringing the tummy in tight. And then when we go down back, we're going to glute bridge. Let's get ready. Crunch, glute bridge. Crunch, glute bridge. Come on, keep it going. Make sure you're, all your weight is in your heels. Toes are off the ground. We got 10 more seconds. Three, two, one, rest. Get ready for suitcases. Backs up straight. We're gonna bring our legs in to our chest together. We can either have our hands out to the back of us or have our hands here hovering. Ready? Three, two, one. So we're doing this or we have our hands right here as little kick stance. Little kick stance right here. Come on, keep it going. Get those abs. See if you can hover. See if you can take those kick stands away. Bring all the weight into your tummy. Come on, three, two, one. Whew. Next up, V-sit hold. Y'all ready? So, if you wanna really take it up a notch, hollow hold. So you're here, feet on the ground, our feet hovering, and we're just gonna straight back, lean back, and hold it here for 30 seconds. You got this, you can kill it. 
So feet on the ground, feet hovering. Let's hold. Come on. Let me watch my timer. I'm putting my glasses on so I can see. So I don't cheat, you guys. Come on. We're halfway done. Hover. Check your stance. Backs not rounded, straight backs. Don't let your tummy core up. Do a deep breath out, blow those candles up. Three, two, one, relax. All right, y'all. We were supposed to have one more round of those abs, but I cut into it. So I want you to lay down on your mat, give a full body stretch from wall to wall, point those toes to one wall, reach for the other wall, stretch those stomachs out. Bring that right knee in to your chest, give it a good big hug, eyes still looking up at the ceiling. Deep breaths right here. Take that deep breath and pull your knee in just a little bit more. Take that right ankle, put it on the left knee, and we're gonna reach through the hole, wrap around that left leg, and pull it in. Let's start rotating that left ankle one way or the other. And then we are going to switch directions. And this is my awkward direction. It just, it, it's so weird. It's so weird to me. Okay, make sure we're still stretching that right leg, right hamstring. Oh goodness, okay. Left leg down, right leg down. Let's bring that left leg into your chest. Give it a big hug. Deep breath here, pull it in tighter to your chest. Take that left ankle, put on your right knee, reach to the center. Let's rotate that right ankle. Switch directions. Right leg down, left leg down. I want you to flip it over into child's pose. Sit back in that, getting a good stretch in your arms and the back of your legs and your booty and your hips. Take that right arm and let's flip it into the little gap underneath your left arm. I want you to reach as far as you can and put that left ear to the ground, looking to your right side. Couple deep breaths right here. Let's switch arms. Left arm going through underneath your right arm, walking it out just a little bit. Ear to the ground. Good stretch in your shoulder. A couple deep breaths right here. 